June the Groomer, um, just wanted to answer uh, Crystal LaCroix's uh, question. Um, she asked it, uh, I think, anyways. Uh, it was one of my last other videos, but um, this is the dryer that I use. Uh, Go Pet Club LLC Go... Uh, let me see if I can focus it a little bit. It's called a uh, Go Pet Club um, Pet Dryer. And this was about 60 bucks on Amazon. So, and my wife found it for me. So, um, that's the dryer that I use. Um, but here is the point that I wanted to make because um, I wanted to answer this question because I felt like it was a good opportunity to make a really good point. Um, when you're drying, right, you're not drying the hair, you're drying the skin. So, um, you know, a lot of times, uh, you know, we get we get fooled. We think that the the, the coat is dry, and then the coat may be dry, the hair may be dry, um, but the skin is not dry. So, for example, the two huskies that I groomed today, one had short um, silver and uh, black hair, white and black, you know. The other one was brown and white, and she had long hair um, and two different types of coats. But the short hair took longer to dry. You know, it's surprising like, to me too. It surprised me as well. But the short hair took longer to dry because um, it's not the hair that wasn't drying. It was the skin. The skin was still wet. So even though I went through and dried the hair and the hair felt kind of dry, especially on the legs, when I would go through and work the other areas and come back to the legs, the legs would be wet again, you know? And so because the hair, the skin is not dry, um, I want to make this quick because I don't want to waste too much time. Um, my wife and I went to a dog show, an AKC show down in uh, South Georgia, and we spoke to one of the Cavalier uh, owner, like breeders. She was about to, the handlers. She was about to take her Cavalier out to the show, um, on the show ring. But anyways, she was telling us that most owners aren't drying the skin. You know, when the dogs go out and get their feet wet and they come back in, um, they might like dry the, the hair with the towel, but they're not drying the skin. And she's saying when the skin stays wet, that's when it starts to get yucky and gets yeasty and bacteria and, you know, you get all these uh, skin issues on their feet and it turns brown. So she's saying when your dogs go out and their feet get wet, dr uh, get a blow dryer and dry their, their skin to make sure their skin is dry. Um, and also, my what I was using before this force dryer, I was using a easy dry adjustable force dryer with an adjustable knob. That conked out on me. <laughs> it doesn't work anymore. But and so that's why I had to use this one. But for emergency, I went and bought um, a hand dryer, so just a regular hand dryer, right? At um, I think I went to Rite Aid and bought it. Um, but anyways. Uh, it surprisingly enough, it didn't take any more time to dry the dogs, even two great Pyrenees. I, I actually washed and dried two great Pyrenees with the hand dryer. I actually had a lot of anxiety going into it because I, I was think I was dreading it. I, I, re I really thought it was going to be a nightmare and take all day long. But it actually, surprisingly enough, didn't take that much longer than it would have with the force dryer. The only difference is it took a lot more effort. I was brushing a lot more and combing a lot more um, while drying and so it took a lot more effort and I was sweating you know so a lot more calories were burned <laughs> but uh, it didn't take that much more time than um, it would take we would have taken me with the force dryer to dry them so the point is you can use a hand dryer you can use a force dryer you can use any kind of dryer you want just keep in mind that the the focus your your the main point is to dry the skin, not the hair. So as long as you're drying this, getting the skin dry, it doesn't matter how you're doing it. Just as long as you get the skin dry. Um, and once the skin dries, then the hair will by default be dry. So you don't even have to worry about the hair. Just really focus on the skin and try to get the skin dry and everything will be great. Bye guys.